is another sad chapter for Tiger Woods. His six-year marriage to Elon Nordegren is now officially over. CBS News correspondent Ben Tracy joins us from Paramus, New Jersey, with the details on their divorce. Ben, good morning. Good morning, Erica. You know, Tiger Woods is expected here at the Ridgewood Country Club this week for a tournament, but unfortunately for him, the focus is likely to be less on his golf and more on his personal life. Tiger Woods and Elon Nordegren were once the picture-perfect couple, the golf great, and his model wife. But in court documents, the two say their marriage is irretrievably broken, and Elon Woods asked that her maiden name be restored. Elon has handled everything to do with this awful episode of Tiger's infidelities with incredible grace. In a joint statement, Woods and Nordegren said, we are sad that our marriage is over and we wish each other the very best for the future. I need an ambulance immediately. I have someone down. It all began to unravel just before Thanksgiving last year when Woods crashed his car outside the couple's Florida home. Then the tabloid frenzy when it was revealed that he had been cheating, possibly with several different women. Court documents show the two reached a settlement in early July. The terms are unknown, but Elon is expected to get about $100 million. The two reportedly revised their prenuptial agreement after the scandal broke. Since then, Woods has lost an estimated 18 to $25 million in endorsements and spent two months in sex rehab. He's back on the course, but clearly off his game. His worst golf performance ever as a professional was a couple of weeks ago in Akron, Ohio. He was 18 over par and finished tied for 78th. It's all been a mental problem for Tiger Woods in 2010. Woods and Nordegren reportedly plan to share custody of their children, three-year-old daughter Sam and 19-month-old son Charlie. They each recently completed a four-hour parenting course. Now, Tiger Woods is a notoriously private person, and he said very little lately about his relationship with his wife, but we do know they have basically lived separate lives for the last couple of months. Now, what if anything he says once he shows up here at the golf course is still anyone's guess. Erica. All right, Ben Tracy in Paramus, New Jersey. Ben, thanks.